two coordinators under John Fox, now coaching in the same division. I mean, this is, we talk about trade there secrets we go. known back and forth. Got it. This is a sign very interesting as you look ahead. But now Oakland, we've talked about what they got to do. Could they do a... Would they do a quarterback? Would they do Geno? Should they? I don't think so. I think, I think Matt Flynn, we can argue with Matt Flynn whether he's the guy or he does, isn't the guy, but they seem to feel they're going to move forward with Matt Flynn. You have four defensive tackles, three sports from Florida, Sheldon Richardson, Missouri, Starlet Fulale, Utah, and Sylvester Williams, North Carolina, all still on the board, as well as the fast-rising corner, D.J. Hayden from Houston. Two biggest needs on this team, cornerback, a defensive tackle, the four defensive tackles, and a fast-rising corner. I don't know how you go a different direction, John. They traded down once. Maybe they're going to trade down again. They need players. They need picks. They need a corner. There's no question about it. I think the room is split on B.J. Hayden. He's got some issues with his health. People are concerned about that, Mel. Talk about Boy, it. Boy, he had a, a heck of a year going at the University of Houston with the Cougars. Then that ruptured vein, the heart, it was a career-threatening injury. Uh, you know, to survive that and come back and become a first-round graduate again is amazing. You root for D.J. Hayden. You hope he goes in round one. Heck of a football player. But as John said, uh, yeah, this is something that may concern a team or two. But he's uh, right now in some two schools. So the Raiders 4 and 12 a year ago try to rebound as we said in year two of TM Reggie McKenzie who comes out of Green Bay where they certainly knew how to build the team. So now the pick is up, the Raiders are up with the Jets up again which means that'll bring the crowd back into the ball game. Oh, the pick is not there yet. So again to recap, now he's there. Carson Palmer member is now in Arizona in case you weren't with us an hour ago when we recapped the Raiders. Now it's their turn. With the 12th pick no. in the 2013 NFL Draft, the Oakland Raiders select DJ Hayden, defensive back, Houston. Wow, we got a quarter? Last night, we were hearing that name of the Raiders. Dang it, Reggie! Why'd you get a quarter? We wanted Luke Delaney. No. Well, close enough. We need a quarter badly since Namde left. Well, close enough. Let's see what this guy can do. But if he fails us, he's history. You don't go and get an intercept the pass on first down. Forget about it. They'll get a touchdown on second down. Not the old days where run, run, throw on third, and drop the third down interception. That's a punt. This kid's ball skills are very good. They get the kid with 5'11". I guess I'll hopefully we pick a D-tackle in the second round. Because we need one badly. In terms of run support. But his anticipation, the way he closes, his awareness and coverage. In this lift shot, I think he's well suited for today's NFL. He's a former high school wide receiver, and I think he plays like that. He's a left corner. When you watch in Louisiana, a tech film, I didn't see him tackle. That bothers me. You have to be able to tackle off the edge in pro football. That's the only concern, his health and his ability to tackle. So more on the pick. Uh, Susie Culver on DJ Hayden with the Raiders. And boom, this may be one of the best stories of the draft because Hayden is a medical miracle. It was just last November on the Houston practice field that Hayden took a knee to the chest, severing the vein, the back of his heart. It's the vein that carries blood from the Ooh, you guys hear that? Now, it's usually associated with car wrecks, and it's considered 95% fatal. His surgeon described it as trying to stitch pieces of wet toilet paper back together. And typically, a patient would spend six weeks in the hospital. He spent six days, and six months later, he's a first-round draft pick. Now, he has been cleared medically and last week he did a workout for at least 16 teams when coaches asked him if he's afraid to get back out there again he insists he has no fear he just needs to take another hit but coaches i talked to were concerned whether he could be the same player again and there is no precedent for this no one has ever seen anything like that but clearly the raiders believe and a guy we can root for and you described that like putting toilet tissue back together that's unbelievable Clearly a guy you can root for. And now, for the second time, the Raiders have picked. The Jets are on the clock. Um, at number nine, the 